Ticks can transmit deadly diseases to your pet within 24 hours of a bite, so swift removal is key. Here's the best way to remove a tick from your dog or cat so you're prepared to get rid of these dangerous parasites. First, you'll need a pair of latex or rubber gloves because ticks carry infectious agents that can seep into the human bloodstream through breaks in the skin. It's best to play it safe and wear protective gear. When getting ready to remove a tick, it's important to keep your pet calm because any unusual poking or prodding tends to make pets nervous. If there's someone else available, have that person hold your pet to help keep her calm. And now you're ready to remove the tick. Take a pair of tweezers. The pointy kind work best and grab a hold of the tick as close to your dog's skin as possible. Be careful not to pinch though. Using steady pressure, pull the tick out using a straight motion. Be careful not to twist or jerk the tick because you want to avoid leaving mouth parts behind. Also make sure not to squeeze or crush the tick because the fluids may contain infectious materials. Kill the tick by placing it in a container of rubbing alcohol. Once the tick is dead, most veterinarians recommend keeping the tick in a container with a lid in case your pet starts displaying symptoms of a disease. Your veterinarian might want to evaluate the tick if your pet starts showing signs of infection. Use antiseptic spray or rubbing alcohol to disinfect the bite site. Keep an eye on it for signs of infection. If the area becomes red or inflamed, make an appointment with your veterinarian right away. Make sure to keep a close eye on your dog or cat over the next few weeks and be on the lookout for any strange symptoms like reluctance to move, fever, fatigue, loss of appetite, or swollen lymph nodes. If your pet displays any of these symptoms, make an appointment with your veterinarian right away.